Joseph. And this is our project, the Smart Pipeline Not On Pipe System. In Kenya, we have, a, we have a water crisis problem where 40% 40, 40 of water in Nairobi is unaccounted for, and this is due to heat issues. To come to that problem, we came up with the pipeline not challenge solution where we can be able to monitor the water distribution actively so that we can be able to get the volume of water flowing in each and every filter. And this allows us to detect our target market is for large scale water suppliers such as companies and companies and companies. And we are also planning on targeting a scale pipe irrigation scheme and also in the future we are also planning to integrate more sensors we will to target the petroleum products and the petroleum pipeline process. Our system gives the user ability to give the user more access to their supply system and with this they can be able to see their, the, the volumes flowing through the system in real time and they can be able to activate different functions remotely and this is going to save the user, the user time and also prevent loss that can be So right now the system is running and we have just started the system. As you can see water is flowing through the system. Water is flowing through the system and the volumes, the volumes flowing through each and every system is being recorded. It's being displayed on the on the display on the device. So the, the device gives us the display, the volume of water flowing through it before uploading the data. As now as we can see now. The data has been is being uploaded to the to the Wazi to the Wazi gate. So so the data has been uploaded. That's the data that we have received just right now. And from here, the Wazi the Wazi app dashboard has been updated on the same same data. So it's refreshing, and now the data has been uploaded to the uh, to the Wazi to the Wazi cloud from there the data is sent to into our site where we can be able to actively monitor the data during days days da daily data for example this is the yesterday from there you can see that there was no data sent during that day and there is no data for the previous day so that's how the site works mm -hmm. when we turn when we turn the system off it's supposed to turn the solenoid off and show that the system is off by turning the, the indicator to red.